a lot of good looks, uh, you know, whatever, eight or nine games, like you said, so nice to see him get rewarded, same with Colts. Present has given you a few good games, comes in tonight, Colts in fourth or third, just what's stood out about his game since he's come over? Yeah, big guy, everything kind of hits him, I think, and uh, he's got a great attitude, you know, he was upbeat, he's chatty in the room, which is rare as a, for a goalie, um, you know, he's you know, going in after two periods, cold, it's, it's pretty impressive the way he played. Power play's been slumping just a little bit lately, do you feel like that goal was just kind of, it was coming and coming and just finally break through? Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess, I mean, we haven't really generated a ton either, so we had a lot of good looks tonight, uh, it was nice that Kill had an awesome shot, that was a bomb, um, yeah, you know, like I said, we had some good looks, but definitely something we need to keep working on. A lot of sustained pressure there in the offensive zone for you guys, was it tough to stay positive when they weren't going in? Uh, it's always a little frustrating, but you have to kind of check yourself. And it's better than uh, you know being hemmed in and not draining or anything. So I felt like uh, we all felt like after the second we were wearing them down a little bit, regardless of what the score was. Uh, you know they had five D the whole game, so we felt like we were getting to them. And um, I think we were right. And I thought, uh, they looked a little tired. Nico uh, just um, huge goals for us tonight and, uh, for for two CS first of the season. There that, that was awesome. So. Um, no, I think. I mean, we've shown shown glimpses of it um, throughout the throughout the year. I think we've we've struggled to show a full 60 at times, um, but to sh have that resilience, especially going into the third period, two goals down, um, knowing that it's going to be a grind, and everybody's staying committed to that grind and not just trying to score every shift, um, shows a lot of growth. That's for sure. I'm sure you never want to give up five goals. The guys also haven't really had one this year where you kind of just had like a mad dash to come back. I'm sure you guys know you can do that from years past, but just what does it mean to just do it this time, given how many guys have lost recently? Yeah, I think it's important. Obviously, you want to win in every different way. Obviously, you don't always want to be a shootout, but um, especially, I think, for new guys and then even um, returning guys, guys who have been here, it's good to build that confidence knowing that regardless of how many goals we're down, we can come back. And I think that's something we lacked at the beginning of the year when we get a couple goals down and kind of back off. So, um, for us, I think a big character win and it shows shows where everybody's heart's at, that's for sure. Last couple, it's Thanks, Like, you know, when it's happening, you kind of get in going, you know, a little bit. Uh, so, it felt pretty good. To, uh, just, UC told me not to, you know, do too much. <laughs> so, I guess I didn't. And uh, I've been in this spot a lot, you know, uh, going into the games like this and uh, minors and in the NHL as well. Played my first game like that, right? Here in Colorado. Uh, my goal partner got pulled and I have to and go in. But I think, well, we scored six six goals. I mean, it's, it's a lot. So you, you know, you have to put on the show when you when your team do that. So, uh, but I think they made it easily. And for me as well, defensively, right? There was not many uh, rushes. I think they didn't go up any rushes uh, today. So we did a really good job eliminating that. So, felt pretty good. Nathan mentioned that going into the third period, it didn't really feel like you guys were down two goals or five three. Did you kind of see it the same way? Did you know that there was something left for this team to give? Well, we, we were all over them, you know. Uh, I think they scored in a couple, couple uh, you know, mistakes that they made, and uh, but we were all over them for two periods, you know. And uh, uh, you know, I think, I think we've been doing a good job all two periods. And coach came in and said, "Yeah, let's go, guys. We, we win in this game." And when he says that, when Bezzi says that, like we always, you know, I, I have a belief. I don't know why. I, I always, like, whatever the score is, when he says we're winning, like, we usually win. And I kind of, you know, I got, it, got the guys going. And, uh, you know, we were excited going into the third. What do you eat during the game? I'm just. This game, but in general, what are you kind of seeing from Pro Scott? It kind of seems like he's been a little even keeled here in the last few instances. Yeah, um, he battles every day. Um, comes to the rink, uh, does his work, does extra work, which is awesome to see. So um, to see him come in kind of cold and shut the door was, was huge. And, you know, he didn't just come in and kind of make one save. He, he kept us in that for sure. So um, credit to him. He, he was awesome tonight. What's uh, what's it like seeing Nate play at the level he's been at the last few games here? Yeah, it's, uh, it's been awesome. It's kind of, you know, you see uh, he works his ass off and, uh, you know, in practice and, you know, doing extra work and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, he, he just, he could take control of the game whenever he wants to. And um, he, we've been seeing that for this last however many stretch of games. He, he's been awesome. And um, I think kind of was, he, uh, he laid a nice big hit there in the second period. And I think that kind of jolted the guys uh, to see him kind of play physical. The guys kind of want to feed off that. And, and then to see him score, get an assist. I mean, it was just, it was a good game.
How nice is it to see Tatar get one? Yeah, no, it's it's huge. You know, I, I said that before. I said he, he comes to the rink every day. He's, he's had a great attitude. Um, he does a lot of things right, and um, obviously he wants to score. He's a goal scorer, so um, hopefully they come in bunches now for him. Is that third period maybe the kind of thing that can shake this team out of the funk it's been in? Yeah, I think for sure. I think uh, it's just, you know, a lot of the stuff that's been going wrong has been stuff that we could control in the room. I think a lot of it's effort. And, uh, you know, I think sometimes we're pressing too much to score and kind of taking our foot off the gas in the D zone when it should probably be the other way around. And we should be content with winning the game 2 1. So, um, yeah, that was a great third period, but, you know, we got to play like that, you know, for a full 60. I think I read this morning that you said that you kind of want your line to, to bring energy and you think that's kind of your responsibility. What do you think the tone set? What tone do you think you set early with that hit um, and then drawing the power play? Yeah, uh, I mean, first, I mean, I hope he's okay. I mean, yeah. uh, you know, I didn't mean, I don't even really think I tried to hit him. I kind of just, you know, saw the puck coming. I tried to angle him off, and, um, you know, I think I got a shoulder, and, you know, I, I, wanted, I don't, I got to watch it again. I don't really know what happened, but, um, yeah, hope he's okay. But, you know, we just wanted to come out the first five minutes and um, play hard and play physical. And, you know, especially these last couple of games, I think we've been playing not as physical as we wanted to. So, um, especially our line, you know, we got Woody, we got to see big, strong guys that play fast. And, you know, so if we can get pucks behind D, kind of make them, you know, fear us on the forecheck, I think we'll have a lot of success. Last couple for us. Thanks. Awesome. Well, I think we we'll just stick with it. Yeah, I think we played two periods. So just didn't give up. You know, we had a good shot second two in the second intermission. We got to shut it down and just keep playing. And they played the whole game with the five D, so not easy. And after all, we got to wear them down. We know we've talked about this. You've been continuing to push, wanting to get back on that scoring touch. You did it here tonight. What does it mean for you moving forward? How much does it feel good to just get back on the right side of things? Feels good, you know. And, and uh, there's actually one thing where I got a lot of extra energy. You know, one of our Finnish NHL players' dad was talking shit about me in the media that I didn't train last summer like I used to do, and and uh, he was just making making things up. So I think that was that was for him, you know. Uh, if you if you talk shit, it's gonna come back at you. So. And Prozvatov comes in, does a great job, of course.